Okay. There is a war on. It's the same war that's been fought every day in this country from the date it was founded. It's the war against black bodies. It's the war against trans bodies. It's the war to fought to protect institutions like these from the fires of our liberation. This bill and bills like it are not declarations of war. They are merely bullets fired. They are attempts on our lives. Yes, to see them as just this misses, misses the larger picture. As long as there is this state, it will try to kill us. As long as there are police, they will target us. As long as there are senators and representatives, they will speak for and over us and they will get in our way. We know what we need. I know when I'm hungry. I know when my friends need protection, when we need housing, when we're sad. And I know those who can help us fill those needs. If we begin and end our fight with stopping bills like these, we cannot make progress. We liberate ourselves by taking this energy and moving it out there by finding community, by finding our fruits, by destroying what destroys us and taking care of each other. There will be no revolution, just as there will be no end of the world. Things will get worse and we will fight back. This, this is revolution. We are each our own revolution. We will fight our revolutions alone until, little by little, we free ourselves. This is that. This is care. There's a war on. It's the same war that's been fought since this country was founded. When this country burns, do not see these those doing the burning as the aggressors. We are simply the target. Opposite of kindness and the opposite of justice. 
going on in the very state that I thought would protect me. I was naive. States will not protect us. They will not, they will not protect us because they are not of the people. They have different priorities than we do. Their priorities mostly go back to money, to getting voters. And right now, my own life is a culture war issue. I am not a culture war issue. I am a person. I am a living, breathing human being. I like going out. I like hanging out with my friends. I like going online on the computer, you know, and playing games and doing normal people shit. So, what is going to liberate us is not just going out and fighting against this anti-trans legislation, anti-black legislation, anti-disabled legislation, and any legislation that will end up taking away the rights of everyday working class Americans, but organizing with on each other. I want everyone after this, after this bill, no matter where the vote goes, even though in my heart I believe that we will win to organize with each other, to talk to one another, to get on a first name basis with one another. Because we are the power, we have the power, and we will unleash our power together. Yeah!